This morning, an autopsy today may confirm that a body found in Wyoming is that of Gabby Petito. Eric Rong is in the newsroom to bring us up to date. Eric. Well, good morning. As we await the autopsy's findings, the search continues for the 22 year old's fiance, who's been named a person of interest in the case. FBI agents remove box after box from 23 year old Brian Laundrie's Florida home, one that he shares with his parents yesterday, even towing away the family car as more evidence points to something violent happening in the days leading up to Gabby Petito's disappearance. A 911 call first obtained by Fox News has a man saying that he saw the couple fighting on a Utah sidewalk. He was slapping her. Yes, and then we stopped. They ran up and down the sidewalk. He proceeded to hit her hopped in the car, and they drove off. Okay, you said it's a white van? Utah police did catch up with the couple that day, and a distraught Petito told them the two had been arguing. Gabby told the officers that she had slapped and scratched Brian. What's you guys' names? Gabby. I'm Brian. Gabby, Brian, okay. What's going on? How come you're crying? I'm just crying. We've just been fighting this morning. Some personal issues. The two were told to separate for the night. Over the weekend, a blogger reported to the FBI that their dash camera caught the couple's white van on the side of the road in the Grand Tetons National Park. Two days after, Petito's family says they last heard from her. Yesterday, a body was found near where the van was spotted. The body appears to be the missing 22-year-old. The cause of death has not been determined at this time. The two took off on a road trip, visiting national parks across the country, documenting their travels on social media. Gabby was reported missing September 11th, more than a week after Laundrie returned home without her. He declined to talk to police about Gabby before he told his family he was going for a hike near his home. It's been nearly a week since anyone has seen or heard from Laundrie. Now, police say they have exhausted their search at that nature preserve. Laundry's parents were questioned by the FBI yesterday. Live in the newsroom, I'm Eric Rump, WGN News.